Eric and welcome back to the channel. Today, as a thumbnail suggests, we're going to be doing a haul video, okay? And before you click away, make sure you watch to the end. I'm going to have a very special guest with me today, okay? Uh, some of the stuff in this haul belongs to him. Uh, he, from time to time, comes over and builds sets here with me and I'll help him out a little bit. But uh, he's also going to do a review, a short abbreviated review of a set that he built today. All right. So without further ado, we're going to get right into it. We got lots to go over here today. But before we get to that really quick, I want to show you something. All right. Today, uh, you might be wondering why this stuff is here. I got my Sig Fig and he is actually almost complete. I say almost because we're going to do one more phase of the actual head. This is the Mayor of Millbrick body. We're going to go with this. This came from the latest town set with the limo and the yellow train. Uh, it says mayor across the front of there. We're actually going to switch this head out for the T'Challa head in the Marvel sets. It comes with a beard, so I think that one will fit a little closer to my likeness. This one actually came from the Nick Fury poly bag with the phone booth and Captain Marvel. So we're going to switch this one out with that one once I can get a T'Challa one. I've been having a, a hard time trying to find a T'Challa Marvel poly bag or even a poly bag, Marvel poly bag at all. Walgreens, Kohl's, uh, Target, Best Buy even, Walmart, everyone's out. What's the deal, Lego? Let's get some more of those Marvel poly bags out. You also may be wondering why this is here. So the mayor has approved the city for light rail. We've had it for a while. This came from Lego set 697 I believe it is. It was another town center with the light rail train, okay? The mayor has approved the town for light rail. So in this bag, you will also see some parts that's gonna make this set operational and start moving in and around our city, all right? So let's get right into it. Before we get going, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Here we go. Okay, so let's pull out the first thing. As we suggested right here, we got the light rail. So the first thing we bought, and I've already opened this up, I got a little excited, was a power box or a hub. What do they call it? It doesn't say, I guess I messed up the packaging, but it's a 1.5 volt battery box that's gonna go in here somehow. And then also the actual motorized piece that's gonna get this thing up and running. So I already have the latest uh, train set with the remote that you can uh, connect more than one train to, but you can also use your cell phone to operate that. So these two pieces will have to go inside of here. I probably won't do a video on it because there's tons of them out there, but I'm gonna put these in here, make this run, okay? So that is that. We will move those off to the side a bit. Next, I picked up a cup of blue two by two blocks. And these, if you have a city and you're moving to mills, you know how important it is to have these. Now, my son went up to Atlanta two days prior to me, and he also picked up two cups for me. But as luck would have it, in his rush to get back home last night, he forgot those two. So there are two more cups of pieces coming as well. All right, so now I'm gonna get on to my assistant for the day's sets. All right, his first set is this right here. It is the Batman versus Joker Batmobile Chase. 136 pieces and it's four plus. So this is his first set that uh, he's got, okay? So um, next is his built, what is it? Mail plane, 74 pieces. It's a Lego City set. It's set 60250, okay? So that's another set that he has, all right? He's also got Lego set 60284, road work truck. It comes with a cool little uh, rat in there. So when you're building and tearing up the ground, it looks like he's tearing up the, the sewer and it's letting out some, some rodents. So beware for those rodents. The next set we have is set 60241, police dog unit. So this guy has just stole some jewels out of 
what looks like a uh, jewelry case and the police are in hot pursuit, all right? He also got this one here, but he opened it, as you can see, and he built that one today. And this is the set he's gonna do the review on at the end of the show. Uh, 60275, 51 pieces. It is police helicopter, all right? So that is all for that bag, all right? So next up, we have the first thing coming out of my bag is going to be Lego set 75810, and it is Stranger Things. I've been wanting this set for a while. Um, I don't know why I didn't get it, but you know, I've been hearing people online say for a while now uh, that it's going away, so I wanted to make sure I got it. I know a few months back there's some rumors that possibly Lego might be doing something else in, in terms of Stranger Things, so I wanted to make sure that I had this set. Uh, I love Hopper's truck there. Uh, this may be more of a display piece for me as opposed to something going into the city with the exception of the kids and Hopper's truck. But wanted to make sure that I got this set. This is a uh, rare piece and I didn't want to lo uh, lose out on it. Next is another one that they say that's going to be going away. And this is my final one of the day. It is the Lego set. 21322, and that is the Pirates of Barracuda Bay. All right, I've never actually owned a Pirates themed Lego set, but this thing is awesome. It comes with uh, you can it's kind of like a it's kind of like a Lego three in one set in that you can build a ship or you can build this island. Uh, if you had two, you can build the, the strand, the deserted island, and another ship. It's got some uh, callbacks to some other sets here, like the um, the totem when you build the island set. It's also got a cool pig in there, and it's got some some actual characters that used to be in older Lego sets. Even those those sig things have got more tattoos and stuff as they age in Lego time. So this is going to be a very interesting one. I know some people have put them in their theme parks and things like that. This one for me is gonna be more of a display piece. I don't think I can really put it into my city as it stands right now, but I wanted to make sure I got it. I'm very excited about this set. Um, that's all I have for today. Don't go away, cause right now, up next is gonna be my very special guest who is gonna talk to you about this set right here and get his thoughts on it. Today, I'm doing a review on Lego set 60275 helicopter, police helicopters. There's, 50, there's 51 pieces. First, I have, I have the helicopter. You can open this part and this part can spin, but this part really doesn't move that much. And sometimes it makes screeching noise. And then, I don't know what this part's for, but this part comes, it can open from the back, back and it has a light, a light, and it can move different direct directions. And it has the wheel so it can lay, land properly. Then we have the back, the back girl. So, so she, so if you look at the back, she has, she has stripes and stuff, and she has handcuffs on, on and a, ba a mad face. And then there's some there's some extra handcuff handcuffs. So just in case if you lose these ones, you can you have these extra ones. And then there's a police a police guy with a blue hat which is my favorite color and he has a tele a telephone thing and a badge and another telephone thing and in a belt and if you look at the back he has 
he has a police sign. Then there's a jet ski and this part right here moves. So it moves in different directions and it has the 100 and it has the 100 dollar on it right here. All right, thank you for watching. See you next time.